You have always had your fridge set to 55 degrees and it's suddenly reading 75. What do you do? In this video, we will walk you through a few simple steps to troubleshoot your beverage refrigerator. The first thing to do is to ask yourself a few questions to try and determine the cause of your fridge's issue. Where is the unit located? If your refrigerator is located in a garage that reaches as high as 90 degrees in the summer months, it will have to work too hard to keep cool and will not perform at its best. You will want to try moving the unit into the house where the temperature is cooler to see if it resumes normal performance. Has anything changed recently about the way you use your unit or the environment it is located in? Have the contents of your fridge recently been reduced? An empty refrigerator will not maintain air temperature as well as a full one, so it will cycle more often. Have you added a new case of wine bottles or a fresh keg to the unit? It may take some time for the fridge to cool those contents down, so the temperature may be higher and the compressor may have to run longer until the optimal temperature is reached. Have there been any major changes in the weather? Changes in temperature or humidity can lead to performance issues such as leaking. If the cause of your issue is still a mystery, you'll want to try what is called a hard reset. Unplug your unit from the wall for 30 to 45 minutes. Then plug the unit back in. This will reset the unit and in some cases may be enough to fix the issue entirely. If the hard reset has not resolved the issue, you should take a liquid temperature reading. For this reading, you will need to place a glass of water inside the fridge for 24 hours. Then use an accurate thermometer to measure the temperature of the water. This will be the truest reading of the temperature your beverages are being cooled to and should be very close to your set point. Try to place the glasses of water in the middle of the unit or in the middle of each zone if possible. If the liquid temperature is drastically different from your set point, or if the unit doesn't seem to be cooling at all, please contact Beverage Factory with this information. Be sure to have proof of purchase and the serial number that is located on the back of the unit. If you didn't purchase your unit from Beverage Factory, please contact the manufacturer. If you like what you saw, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more great content.